What can you do to improve chemical management in your facility? Establish a chemical management system. A chemical management system is an arrangement of methods and tools designed to enhance workplace safety by providing guidelines on how to handle chemicals in a commercial setting. Each facility has its own needs and priorities, meaning that the chemical management system in your facility may be drastically different from the one in another facility. Generally though, every chemical management system is built around three main components, accurate chemical dilution, color-coded labeling, and inventory monitoring. The first step towards implementing a chemical management system is to assure accurate chemical dilution through automation. Automated dilution equipment dilutes cleaning solutions to the correct concentration for their task at hand, reducing the risk of using solutions that are too strong or weak. On top of that, employees no longer have to worry about the hazards that come with handling concentrated cleaning products. An example of automated dilution equipment is a wall-mounted chemical dispensing system. A system like this uses a series of bottle racks, tubes, and hoses to dilute and dispense chemicals as needed automatically. Some facilities have their own system for color coding. However, there is an OSHA approved color coding system that is widely accepted. In OSHA's color coding system, red indicates flammability, blue indicates a health hazard, yellow indicates instability hazards, white indicates a contact hazard, and black is used for chemicals that don't pose a safety threat. It also helps to color code the equipment and tools used with these chemicals. For example, by color coding your microfiber cloth, you greatly reduce the risk of cross-contamination. Most times the color coding guidelines are listed in or around the chemical storage area on a bulletin board or pasted on the wall. Color coded chemicals help employees understand the difference between the two products as well as where they should be used. It also helps el eliminate language barriers in the field. This reduces the risk of employees using the wrong chemical for a job, which can be harmful to the employee and the affected surface. The third part of a chemical management system is inventory monitoring. Tracking inventory levels in real time ensures that employees have access to the right chemicals for the job. This helps prevent unexpected shortages or stockouts during cleaning tasks. One such way to track your chemical inventory is through a smart management system. Smart management systems use the Internet of Things to track and monitor a large number of data points, such as what products are in stock and which products are running low. The information is then used to reduce product waste and increase efficiencies. If you're looking for a way to improve safety in your facility or simply want to create a comprehensive guide for chemical handling, look into setting up a chemical management system. If you're interested in learning more about what a chemical management system can do for your facility, or if you wanted to get started on your own chemical management system today, please reach out to an Imperial Dade facility near you. One of our janitorial and sanitation experts is waiting on the other end of the line to give you a free evaluation of your facility's needs and provide you with the next steps for implementing a chemical management system. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below.